Dr. Weld has regained consciousness. It looks like he'll be fine. That's a relief. You don't seem relieved. You can tell that just by observing me. The tone of my voice, my eyes, my body movement. Yes? You are truly a remarkable life form, Odo. But there is so much about you we still don't understand. What are you getting at, Doctor? The computer has broken down the DNA chain from the organic sample we found in the infirmary. Dax is running an analysis of it now. She'll identify it in a couple of hours, but I already know what it is. I've seen it before. The organic sample. It's from you, Odo. The destruction in the science lab occurred at 0300 hours, five minutes. The attack in the infirmary occurred at 1935, roughly 16 hours apart. Is your rejuvenation period still 16 hours? Ah. I was in my pail during both attacks. But were you? I don't think so. I think, Odo, that you've been placed in the ironic position of having to track down yourself. <sighs> How could this be? Has anything like this ever occurred before? Of course not. Are you certain? Yes, I'm certain. There would have been incidents. Any unsolved crimes on the book? There are always unsolved crimes. Then the possibility exists. It doesn't! I do not commit criminal acts. It is not in my nature. Isn't it? <laughs> the gas. Maybe it was the gas on the planet. It affected all of you. It must have done something to me. A possibility. That has to be it. Certainly worthy of an investigation. Dr. Bashir. Dr. Dr. Bashir will not understand any of this. Except that you have turned into some kind of uncontrolled thing that tried to kill him. Really, Odo? What do you think they'll do with you? Do? They won't know what to do with you. They'll put you in a high-security prison or quarantine you on a deserted asteroid and a gamma quadrant. Oh, no, they'll put you in a zoo. I don't believe that. You don't know them. What other humanoid have you been able to trust except me? What makes you think I trust you? I resent that. I really do. After all the time I invested in you, after the education I gave you, the attention I gave you, you would not be here today if it weren't for my guidance. I gave you more than anyone else in my life. You were my life. And then you walked away. And now you don't trust me. Fine. Put yourself in their hands. You always had to learn your lesson the hard way, didn't you? I... I'm not going back to the center with you. Why? We'll work through this together. We'll solve it together just like we used to. No! <laughs>